The food and beverage industry sees food safety as its number one priority. Now, this has been the case for every year that this survey has been undertaken. This subject is always at the forefront of food manufacturing trends, as one might hope, as we're all, of course, consumers. Additional regulation is constantly being added, and this must, of course, be considered by manufacturing sites. Two of the most important are illustrated here, ISO 22000 and the Food Safety Modernization Act, FSMA, having a similar proactive approach to food safety. As a result of these, there's a growing need for assets and components within assets to comply to food industry requirements, allowing producers to fit and forget and concentrate on their core competence, efficient food production. So the question that we asked was, what if, as part of preventive measures to comply with food safety regulations, you could use bearings with food safety features as standard. The Foodline stainless steel deep groove ball bearing is an ideal solution for virtually all applications in food and beverage processes where corrosion can cause downtime or where food line security is at risk. We also see increasing demand in pharmaceutical and medical applications. The standard catalogue SSDGBB offer has good corrosion resistant and load carrying capabilities. On occasions where there's need to accommodate potential water ingress or to further extend lubricant life, a food grade solid oil can be applied. Customers are today asking for bearings to operate in ever more hostile environments than those seen in normal production environments, for example, where hydrogen peroxide is used in aseptic applications. MRC, high nitrogen, corrosion resistant, stainless steel deep groove ball bearings are well suited for application in such equipment. These bearings exhibit corrosion resistance beyond that seen in more standard stainless steels. As well as advanced corrosion resistance, this range also exhibits high fatigue strength, again well beyond that provided from the more standard stainless steel deep groove ball bearing. Both of these offers have as standard a high quality NSF H1 registered food grade grease fill that provides optimum performance under typical food and beverage applications. And as already touched upon, they're also available on request with an NSF H1 registered food grade solid oil. Now this page details the materials that are used in the construction of SKF food line stainless steel deep groove ball bearings. The bearing rings are made from stainless steel X65 CR13. The cage is in stainless steel X5 CR NI1810. The rolling elements are made of stainless steel X105 CR MO17. The synthetic rubber seals are coloured blue for optical detectability and comply with FDA and EC recommendations. The seal backing plate is, like the cage, made of stainless steel X5 CRNI1810. The bearing is typically lubricated with a high quality grease optimised for typical food and beverage application conditions, registered by NSF as category H1. Now here we see the materials employed in the construction of MRC, ultra corrosion resistant deep groove ball bearings. Now for these bearings, the inner and outer rings are in HNCR stainless steel. Like the food line bearings, the cage is made from stainless steel X5 CR NI1810, but these bearings have ceramic rolling elements. Again, the synthetic rubber seals are coloured blue for optical detectability, complying with FDA and EC recommendations, and the seal backing plate is made of stainless steel X5 CRNI1810. Now these bearings are also typically lubricated with a high quality grease optimised for typical food and beverage application conditions, 
registered by NSF as category H1. One of the main advantages with high nitrogen corrosion resistant steel is fatigue life, as in many applications where corrosion resistance is needed, load capacity can be a limiting factor. As you can see from the data shown here, we have a significant safety factor even over standard 52100 bearing steel. The SKF range of corrosion resistant options comply as far as possible to industry regulations with food compatible lubrication and with optically detectable FDA approved seal material to reduce the risk of food contamination whilst decreasing the cost of maintenance and bearing replacements. Improving reliability and minimizing both planned and unplanned stops for maintenance and replacement adds significantly to the overall efficiency in the plant. To learn more about how you can increase asset reliability, reduce costs and improve food and operator safety in your plant, please see these SKF publications. You can find them in the food and beverage industry area of SKF.com.